How to Start Animating for Beginners If you've ever wanted to dive into the world of animation but didn't know where to start, you've come to the right place. In this video, we'll guide you through the essential steps and tools you need to begin your journey as an animator. So, let's get started. The first step to becoming an animator is to gather your tools. You'll need a computer or a laptop with animation software installed. Some popular options include Adobe Animate, Toon Boom Harmony, or even free software like Pencil 2D or Krita. Explore these tools and choose the one that suits your needs and budget. Next, it's time to familiarize yourself with the basics of animation. Understanding the principles of animation is crucial for creating smooth and lifelike movements. The 12 principles of animation, pioneered by Disney animators, include concepts like squash and stretch, anticipation, and timing. Take some time to study these principles and observe how they are applied in professional animations. Now that you have your tools and knowledge ready, it's time to start animating. Begin by sketching out your ideas on paper. Remember, animation is all about creating a sequence of images that give the illusion of movement. Plan out your storyboards and break down the actions into key frames. This will help you visualize your animation before you bring it to life digitally. Once your storyboard is ready, it's time to transfer your sketches into the digital realm. Scan your drawings or use a drawing tablet to create your digital artwork directly. Make sure to organize your files and name them appropriately for easy access later. Now, open your chosen animation software and create a new project. Import your sketches or start drawing directly on the software's canvas. Most animation software allows you to work with multiple layers, which is beneficial for separating different elements of your animation. With your artwork in place, it's time to start animating. Begin by setting up the keyframes for your animation. Keyframes are the main poses or positions that define the movement. By placing keyframes at specific points in time, you establish the foundation of your animation. Once the keyframes are set, it's time to create the in between frames. These frames bridge the gap between the keyframes and create a smooth transition from one pose to another. Use onion skinning or other tools provided by your software to see the previous and upcoming frames as references while working on the current one. Now, add details, colors, and shading to your animation. Experiment with different techniques and styles to find your unique visual language. Remember to pay attention to the timing and spacing of your animation. You can adjust the speed and easing of movements to make them feel more natural and dynamic. After you're satisfied with your animation, it's time to export your final product. Choose an appropriate file format and resolution that suits your needs. You can export your animation as a video file or as individual frames to be compiled later. Congratulations! You've completed your first animation. Now it's time to share your work with the world. Create a YouTube channel or social media accounts dedicated to your animations. Join online communities and share your progress. Embrace feedback and continuously learn from others in the field. The more you practice and seek constructive criticism, the better you'll become. Remember, animation is a journey of constant learning and improvement. Don't be afraid to experiment and try new techniques. Seek inspiration from other animators and explore different styles. The more you explore, the more you'll develop your own unique artistic voice. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any future content. If you have any questions or comments, please let us know in the comments section below.